everyone, it is me and Louise again. Yay! Oh hi! And together we are going to do a haul video. Haul. An H A U L haul. Haul. We went shopping. <laughs> Did we ever? Well, we kind of knew that we were going to buy a fair bit. Oh wait, we ought to say this is actually going to be on both channels, except oh yeah, this version will be in fantastic quality and edited nicely. My version will just be on my regular camera, not this like most amazing camera in the world, and um, unedited. So it'll be the same things, but we're just going to do it twice. Um, but we why figured, not? Well, we figured since we both bought so much that it'd be nice to both have a video of it to keep for our memories and to show everybody, obviously. Show the world. Not just to keep for ourselves. Show them what we bought. Right. <laughs> you turn everything to a song. I've got a problem. You do. It's a disease. I think it is. So, shall we start with the first place we went? Yes. Which was House of Fraser. Yes. House of Fraser. Ooh, Ooh, exciting. House of Fraser is basically a department store. Yes, a nice one, really nice. Which has lots of different makeup brands in it. Yes, and we took loads of photographs in it. Um, and uh, the lady went, excuse me, you can't photograph our stuff. And I thought, don't call YSL lip glosses stuff. <laughs> Treat them with respect, woman. And I, and I sort of thought, I, I go to Instagram it anyway. Yeah. Does anybody actually know why you cannot take photographs of makeup in, in a shop? Store. So we went to NARS. We went to NARS! NARS! I popped my NARS cherry and bought a duo, which just thrills me. This is the NARS product, and it's beautiful. It's the most pigmented thing in the world. It's gorgeous. Maybe. This one is called Eurydice. Yeah, I would say that's what it's Eurydice. called. Eurydice. And it's a gorgeous, like, deep plum with sort of like a blue sparkle. And the other one is sort of a blacky green with flecks of gold in it. It's like multicolour glitter in that one, though. It's very finely milled, so it's not glitter glitter, is it? No, it's, it's just gorgeous. A little, it's a hint of glitter. And because it's so gorgeous, I got the same one. Packaging. Pretty. Mm. Twins. Twinnies. Twinnies! Also from NARS, I picked up a blush in Lustre. Lustre. Which I'm looks swooning. like this. It is a very gorgeous. I would get I would say that's peachy colour. Mm, I would peach. Peach. Peach colour, which I think would look quite nice in spring. And it has um like golden shimmer, I think. From what I can see there. It's a shimmer, not a glitter, I would yeah, say. Yeah, it's a shimmer. So I think that'll be a really nice one for spring. <laughs> Next. Then we went to the body shop. And oh, we did. Um, I just bought one thing, which was the green apple bath and shower gel. Um, and I, it just smells just like green apples. Mm, I also bought this. Fancy that. It's very reasonable, it was only £2. I also picked up um, a... Fuzzy Peach, which again was £2, and this one is also delicious, and it smells like peach, would you believe? Oh, why did you not buy this one? I wasn't as thrilled with that one, I do like it. I also then got some of these lip balms, because um, the Body Shop actually sent me a few lip balms, and I really enjoyed them, so I decided to buy some more, and I've got Raspberry, which is a pink. Do they come out very coloured on your lips? Uh, not really. Quite, are they quite sheer? Yeah, which I like. I don't want to add too much colour on well, a no, lip balm. Otherwise you'd use, use a lipstick, wouldn't and you? And my favourite, which is guava. guava. And this smells... Ah, oh, delicious. I had a good smell of that. I nearly took all so the So fruity. Away. But yeah, I really, really actually like these. And these were only £2. Do they last very long? Do, you, do they make you feel like... Yeah. For, long, for a long time? Yeah. I like good. And then the last thing I bought was a candle because I've got so much skincare that I need to test out and try. There was no point in me buying any skincare from the body shop. So I thought, I'll be a bit different and I'll buy a body shop candle, which I didn't actually know they did. And it's in, it's, it comes in quite a cute little box, actually. Might, that would make a nice gift. Yeah, it would, actually. Nice little gift. And this one is Aloe and Soft Linen Scented Candle with essential oils. And it smells lovely. Really like you fresh. were saying earlier, if it's got essential oils, 
it burns better, doesn't it? Like if just the whole Apparently thing burns it does. down. Don't get like a waxy residue. We then went to Lush! Lush, 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 Lush. We got the obligatory Lush Times. Ooh. I think, oh, sorry. <laughs> just whack me around the head with it. Shh. Oh, also they've got a thing about a Lush Spa. We're going to go to a Lush Spa, aren't we? Hopefully. Lush. She was explaining it and it sounded really cute. Look, it's like it's like they set it out to look like an English kitchen, apparently. Like a country house. Yeah, like, like a country I house. I actually know someone who's been to one of the spas and she said it was the most amazing thing in the world. We need to go. It's quite pricey, I've just noticed. One facial for £75. Golly gosh. Yikes. Yeah, but it is 60 minutes. How do you massage a face for 60 minutes? Oh, I don't know, but I want it. I actually only bought one thing, uh, but I got two samples, which is really nice, but I'm going to share them with Zoe because she didn't get given any samples, which seemed a bit unfair. I bought a solid perfume, actually, which was, I think, about £7, and it is uh, called Love, and you untwist the cap like this, and I think it's like a pushy-uppy one. Yes, it is. Oh, you'd have to push it out with your finger. And it's sort of a peachy pink colour. Now Zoe, I don't like it. Does not like the smell of this, but I think it just smells like lovely. It's just. Uh, do you know what it smells like? The mango um, bath oil bar. That's what it smells like to me, mango. And it, it smells amazing, and you just literally just like do a little, a little rub down, <laughs> a little rub. Lovely. See what sample yes. I've given. I've had Geo Fizz. Ooh, little bath bomb here. I was going to say you can have it. I'm not even kidding. To me, it, this smells like feces. <laughs> <laughs> that smells horrible. That smells rank. That's why they've given it away as a freebie. This does look alright. Oh, it's half of it. Oh, this also doesn't smell great. <laughs> right. I can't really, really strong, like, like mint sauce. and vomit. And I'll share them. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, I bought um, the first thing that I noticed when I walked in the door was this cute little rabbit. Look. Mm -hmm. And on the top it says Hoppy Easter. Hoppy Easter. I think this must be limited edition for the Easter time. And it's so cute. Mm. I just want to keep it like this forever. You I don't want to photograph it. it. Photograph it. I will. And it has um, a carrot reusable bubble bar, a fruity reusable carrot to swish around your bath for nearly never ending baths, and a fluffy egg bath ballistic. Oh, fluffy pink. eggs are amazing. I think they smell a little bit like Snow Fairy. Mmm. Really sweet. Oh, that's yeah, snow fair. It's amazing, isn't it? Mm. And the carrot. Let's smell the carrot. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like I'm smelling a, like a bunny's bum. Then, lastly, I bought the no, no drought, like no doubt, I guess. Oh, clever. Um, dry shampoo, which I thought was quite interesting. I'd, I'd seen um, somebody else review this and I can't remember who it was. I've seen a couple of people talk about it and it looked quite interesting and actually very, very good. So I thought I'd give it a go and we sprinkled a bit in your hair, didn't we? It looked nice. It was really good and I nearly bought it. But then, then she flaked out at the till. At the till. I might go back and buy it but I felt like... I didn't Let's do a little one. demonstration. No. No, I'd rather we didn't. Maybe another time. Oh, and then this is where the damage was done. My oh my. Doesn't look like much, but these are pretty weighty bags. And I think the main problem was that it was three for two. Yeah. On all beauty brands. So rather all. than just being like, oh, I've got enough, we were like, oh, you need to buy two more things. Then we pick up two more things, then another one thing. We're like, oh, you need to buy two more things. <laughs> Looks like so much. <laughs> what have I done? Okay, so a lot of the things were quite similar because yesterday we filmed a video with Fleur of Fleur de Force and we did um, top five drugstore products for Louise's channel, so you can watch that on her channel. 
Um, and a lot of the things that Fleur had, me and Louise wanted because we were like, oh, that's so cool. And we'd not seen it or done anything. So we basically went out and bought everything that Fleur showed, which is bad. And then some. <laughs> Fleur, you are such an enabler. Damn you, Fleur. So I actually needed a uh, thick tan and I've been using the Garnier Spray on Mist for some time now and I thought I'd have a change. So I bought the Garnier Ombre Solaire No Streaks Bronzer Tinted Self Tan Gel plus Golden Shimmer. That is a mouthful. <sighs> it looks like this and I'm excited to try it. It's good to try new things. Uh, looks a bit like Marmite. But that's what you want in a fake tan, if you ask me. So I then bought a selection of Revlon lip glosses. And they're all just so super sparkly. There's like a pink sparkly one, um, a peachy sparkly one, and then a white sparkly one. And the white sparkly one has like iridescent blue it's shimmer so in it. It's so pretty. Blue it's and gorgeous. pink shimmer. So beautiful. I got that too, actually. Mm. It was funny, I spotted it and then I went and showed Louise and she literally stopped what she was looking at and oh. ran round. Because you said there's only one left. So I, I thought ran. there was only one. She ran, she like barged somebody out the way, excuse me, to get it. And they were like, um, this one is called Crystal Water, this, oh, this pretty Crystal one. Crystal Water, this orangey, sort of peachy one with gold sparklers, Peony. 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 And this fuchsia one with gold sparkle is called Hot Pink. It's not really not an innovative name, is no, it? No, not really. I like the name I of this one though. Crystal Water. Water. We then got these, which Fleur spoke about in the video. And they are the L'Oreal Colour Infallible Iridescent Finish Loose Eyeshadow Thingy My Bobbies. But they're not loose. We bought similar colours, we bought the same brown colour, we both bought Sahara Treasure and I bought Flashback Silver. They come with a little stopper that keeps them pressed down, which is really cool. Um, and then obviously... Like... So they are loose, they're semi-loose aren't they? Damn you Fleur. You um, I see. bought Sahara Treasure, which is a... Let's say it's a taupe shade. Yes, taupe. A goldy taupe and then we've got time resist white which is just a really pretty I think this will look really nice in the um, Corner. corners of the eye then I picked up some bronzers because I'm going to do some bronzer reviews um, so I picked up the collection 2000 shimmer shades in uh, way to glow uh, see what they did there I love it when they do a bit of a comedy name so that's way to glow I also picked up the bourgeois um, delice de poudre Delisty poudre, delisty poudre, um, and it looks like chocolate. I'll have to look at mm, the box. Apparently, it smells like chocolate too. <gasps> Let's see. Let's do the smell test. By Jove, it does. Let me smell it. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I just dipped my nose in it. And I also <laughs> bought the 17 Instant Glow Bronzing Powder for face and body because I just really liked it, and it's big. Like, look, I mean. Burn. It's gonna last you a while. Yes, and you can really get a good swirl on with your brush. The right. next thing we both got because of Fleur are the um, Maybelline, Maybelline Colour Tattoo 24 Hour. But underneath it says gel cream. So they're a gel cream, like a paint pot. So I would say they're actually more creamy than a paint pot. I bought Turquoise Forever and also On and On Bronze. And I got on and on bronze as well. I think this would be nice as um, an eyeliner colour mm, as well. That would be nice. Really poppy. Next. Next up, we both bought these as well. Yeah. Um, these are new and they're the L'Oreal... What are they called? L'Oreal Caress. Is that what it's? Caress. The L'Oreal Caress. Is that what they are? Yes, the Caress um, lipsticks. And they're a lot like the, the butters, the Revlon lip butters. Um, but I love the packaging of them. I think they're really pretty. And again, this is Fleur that made us want to go and buy these. Bloody Fleur. That's the last time we spend time with you. Yeah. Um, and they're just really, really pretty. Just lovely. And they're quite sheer, but you do get... They're, they're very, very moisturising. Yeah. They, they feel like they'd quench your lips. Kind of like a, a really, really tinted balm. Mm. Like yeah. super tinted balm. I've bought... Three, which is lovely rose, and also seven, which is cheeky magenta. Cheeky magenta. Cheeky cheeky. I bought cheeky magenta and dating coral. 
I did think it said daring coral, but it's actually dating coral. Well, as in the coral is dating, or you might date whilst wearing it? I don't know. Hey, um, as I have decided to do a sort of high street slash drugstore um, foundation review video, um, I've selected quite a couple, actually not a couple, I've selected quite a lot over a, lot, a, lot. a broad spectrum of brands. Um, and I saw these two today and these are the last that I wanted to add to the collection to try to review for you lot. So um, the first one was the Rimmel Wake Me Up Foundation. I have that and it's amazing. It says anti-fatigue effect and radiant glow. I also got the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer in um, Ivory, which promises to give an anti-fatigue effect and oh, radiant sweet. glow. So I'm looking forward to trying that as well. Next, I got the Bourjois 123 Perfect 3 Correcting Pigments for Imperfection Skin. This looked quite interesting because it says it has yellow pigments for anti-dark circles. It says it has mauve pigments, or is it mauve? Mauve. Mauve. <laughs> mauve. Mauve pigments, anti-dull complexion, and green pigments for anti-redness. So this sounded actually quite interesting, so I'm looking forward to trying that one. And I got that in shade 52, which is vanilla. Whilst you were looking at those, I was at the Maybelline stand. Maybe she's born with it. Maybe, Maybe it's Maybelline. Maybelline. I actually have a friend called Faye, who we call Fabeline. Oh, that's quite a nice name, if that was a real name. Well, once I said, what's your name short for? She's like, oh, it's, it's Fabeline. Really? She, well, I believed it too. I was like, God, oh, that's amazing. But uh, she was she was yanking my chain, pulling my leg, Aww. pulling the wool over my eyes, lying. <laughs> you liar. So I bought three of the Colour Sensational um, lipsticks, which are like a really sheer, I'll show you them, they're really sheer, and they look quite um, moisturising, so I thought they would be nice to add to all the other many lip products I bought. I don't and think you have enough lip products now. I don't think I do either. And I liked the casing. I just thought it was really pretty. And um, I'm looking forward to trying those. And I'll let you know how I get on. Is that everything from you? Let me say what colours I got. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Coral Pearl, Cherry Candy, and Pink Fizz. Well, this was Louise's fault. Of course it was. And I'm going to blame you for this one. Um, recently, you were sent. You went to the press day thing for Pixie, and I couldn't go, so I missed out on that. And Louise said. You need to get these eyeliners because they're absolutely amazing. They are amazing. And then Best she, coloured she eyeliners I've ever tried in my life. She did a little demonstration on my hand, which I kind of still have because I haven't actually used anything to properly scrub it off yet. Which oh. makes me seem grubby, but it was only like... Today. Today. <laughs> um, and so in the end, I ended up getting um, number nine, which is Oyster Glow, which is a really, really, really pretty goldy, pearly, iridescent -y, oh, beige, pretty Soft colour, pink. and I also got black cocoa, which is a really dark, deep brown, and I love my brown eyeliners, so it's amazing, it was, it was a given, and they're so blendable, oh there we go, there's a little picture, oh of it they're side. amazing, okay, so that is everything that we hauled, haul today, and I think you'll agree, today. that's quite a lot, but it excites me, there's so many things to use and try. So many blog posts. I so do love time. a high street slash drugstore splurge. Yes. I don't do them often enough, I don't think. Do you? Well, I never buy a lot of things in one go. I always buy like a few bits here and there, but sometimes it just feels nice to just go a bit crazy, let yourself go. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've seen something that you've kind of liked the look of and I would definitely advise that you take a trip to Boots because all the makeup is three for two. I don't know how long it's on for but go now. now. Go now. Go now. Go right now. Go. 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 And then go to my channel. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. We be rolling. 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 Rolling on a river. Left a good man in the city, good job in the city Working for that man every night and day <clears throat> Then I never lost one minute of sleep And I was worried about the way it might have been Big wheels keep on turning Ooh, The proud man keeps on rolling Burning on something and I'm rolling Right And I, I and her <laughs> All I don't like that word very much. Is it because it sounds like whore? 
Yeah, it just sounds weird. And I also got. <laughs> 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 Next, um, I am for my channel going. <laughs> For my channel, I've decided that I want to ta taste. <laughs> my channel. I want to taste foundations. La 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 la. Crazy clown smashing on the window with okay. like a pasta on his head. Okay, go on then. <gasps> <laughs> that is a crazy. <laughs> Ow. Ow. <laughs> For my, I can see you laughing. <laughs> For my channel, I, no. no. <laughs> I can see you like trying not to laugh. I just move on from it. Okay. Right. For my channel, I've decided to leave. <laughs> that I want to test foundation. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> then oh, so lit. No, so... We're so tired. So tired. <laughs> okay. So I'm, I'm genuinely sorry. I've decided that um, for a